What is going on guys, Jens Garcia here to do a how-to video on how you can install TouchWiz on your Nexus 7. Now first of all, this is not a ported TouchWiz ROM, this is actually from the stable customizable codename Android ROM. But apart from that, you also do get all the features of the TouchWiz UX, such as the pop-up play, get the widget, AccuWeather widget, get the memo app, and even the notification sounds and all those things so now first of all you'll have to download the file from the XDA website but before that I just want to say thanks to Small Dookie for putting this ROM up so it's gonna be an amazing ROM so alright so I said go ahead and download it on the XDA uh, web page or website I'm gonna be putting the link down below so yeah let's go ahead and install the ROM Alright, so first of all, you just want to save the file to your internal memory and after that you just want to go to your recovery mode and obviously we're going to be doing wipe first, wipe cache, yes, swipe and also the cache. Now by the way, this ROM is not going to like fully wipe everything off, so you're going to be seeing that in a sec. So. And then after that, once you wipe it, install. But but obviously, always do a backup in in, ter in case of something bad happens. So because we never know, you never know. All right, there is the file code name Sammy dash one point one. The zip file. Once you you've done the wiping, you just wanna press that or tap it. All right, swipe to confirm flash. Yes, yep. It is now installing system files. All right, so this should take a few minutes to install the ROM. Now you'll also do get different uh, apps from this. So, like for example, the Astro Manager. So it's pretty cool. Really excited to see this ROM, guys. On uh, and how it really looks like well although I've seen it but I'm excited for you guys to see what it looks like on the Nexus 7 alright so flashing boot image alright it's restoring going back to the should go back to the recovery mode now alright Google alright here we go alright reboot so when I go to reboot the device now, yes, system. All right. We'll just wait for that to reboot, and we should have TouchWiz UX on the Nexus Seven. Well, it's not really like pure TouchWiz UX, but it's almost the same. You'll have a different notification bar though, so. <clears throat> By the way, and also by the way, you'll have Nova Launcher as well, so you'll have two choices, Nova Launcher and the, obviously the TouchWiz UX, but we're going to be using the TouchWiz UX for this. Alright, so optimizing app. So it's just getting. Alright, 104. Should finish in a few seconds. Alright. 110, 111. All right. Okay. Starting apps. And there we go. All right. So obviously you'll have that back. You'll have the same lock screen. But as you can see already, there is the wallpaper from the Galaxy S series. All right, just gonna swipe that. All right, there we go. You've got your widget chat on already. Obviously, you get the icons from the TouchWiz as well. So, notification bar. There we go. Same as the original Jelly Bean. Swipe. There we go. Very very smooth. Can definitely tell the smooth transition 
so no lags at all it feels like Galaxy S3 to me alright or Galaxy Note alright so I'm just gonna go apps there are the here is the menu menu app obviously now you do get smart rotator now speaking of smart rotator that's actually gonna let you make everything go on landscape so you'll have different um, choices so for example with the browser if you want that one just on landscape then you can just set that one up let me give you a look there we go I've already set it up before as I said in the beginning it's not gonna wipe everything alright okay so but there you go you've got plenty of choices there just to give you an idea go back home all right what else have we got all right we've got ROM manager you've got Samsung tactile as well so you have plenty of choices there all right over here obviously I've already mentioned the chat on astro file manager you've got your gallery people paper artist our widgets all right there we go Alright, browser, just quick test. Alright. Type in and gadget. By the way, this is a lot different compared to the this is not the Chrome. So it's gonna be different. And gadget. That com. There we go. Pinch to zoom. It is pretty good as well. Now let's go back home see this sort of bug in there that you just saw but alright recent apps okay there we go there's a, another problem in there so as you can see the icons went on the side so alright now let's try go let's go apps settings All right, all right. Let's go about tablet. And as you can see, Android version 4.1.1. Jelly Bean. There we go. All right, mod version unknown. Build number. There we go. Code name Sammy. All right, so there we have it, guys. Hope that gave you an idea. As you can see, it went back to normal already. There's still a few bugs, but it's going to be cool to try this ROM out. So there you have it. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you on my next video. Bye-bye.